Have you ever wondered how the mysteries of aging and immunity can be unraveled in the vast expanse of space? In the silent void beyond our atmosphere, NASA astronaut Laurel O'Hara is probing the secrets of the human mind. Aboard the International Space Station, she's studying brain cell-like samples, part of the cerebral aging study. This research aims to unpick the degenerative processes of brain cells, offering potential insights into accelerated aging symptoms in space and neurodegenerative diseases on Earth. But that's not all. O'Hara is also part of the Cypher Human Research Experiment. This project is a deep dive into the long-term physiological and psychological effects of living in space. It's a journey into the unknown, a journey into us. Space, it seems, is more than just a frontier for exploration. It's a frontier for understanding ourselves, our bodies and our minds. When confined to the microgravity environment, the human body undergoes profound changes, making space a unique laboratory for biomedical research. But what if we could use the unique environment of space to gain biomedical insights? Well, that's exactly what the Expedition 70 crew aboard the International Space Station, or ISS, are doing. Their advanced life science work is focusing on aging and immunity research. European Space Agency Commander Andreas Mogensen is at the forefront of this exploration, conducting a study that investigates cellular immunity in space. How, you ask? By processing blood samples in the human research facility's centrifuge, of course. But the learning doesn't stop there. The crew is also engaged in other activities, such as testing the Colbert treadmill, a vital tool for maintaining the astronaut's physical health in an environment where the usual rules of gravity don't apply. And let's not forget the critical task of replacing components in a device that scrubs carbon dioxide from the ISS atmosphere, ensuring the air remains breathable for our dedicated space explorers. The microgravity environment aboard the ISS allows us to conduct experiments that are impossible on Earth, leading to potentially groundbreaking discoveries. While the mysteries of space continue to unfold, the journey of exploration carries on. As we venture further into the cosmos, the Roscosmos Progress 86 resupply ship is being prepared for launch. Its mission? To dock with the International Space Station, replacing the Progress 84 spaceship, ensuring the continuity of this vital research. As the ground team readies the ship, cosmonauts Oleg Kononenko and Nikolai Chubb are making their own preparations for its arrival. Their work is as fascinating as it is crucial. Kononenko is delving into the future, studying advanced spacecraft and the robotic piloting techniques that may one day guide us to distant stars. Meanwhile, Chubb is exploring a phenomenon that could only be studied in the unique environment of space the effects of electrical and magnetic fields on fluid systems. This research could unlock new understandings of fundamental physics and have far-reaching implications for life on Earth. Our journey into the cosmos is more than just a voyage of discovery. It's a testament to our relentless curiosity, our drive to understand the universe and our place within it. To continuously be enlightened, like and subscribe. Space may be the final frontier, but every day we are unlocking its secrets, one mission at a time.